<laughs> Alright, so what's good with y'all young boys and girls, man? As y'all can see by today's title and thumbnail, I'm gonna be giving y'all eight different styles for your locks if you have them, men or female. Because I know a lot of people got locks but don't really know what to do and how to style them. Like, having them down, you know, that's cool and all, but don't you want to spice up your locks? Trust me, and if you have, like, the starter locks and your shit ain't really, you ain't really got the hang time yet, twin, this video can still be used for you. You just gotta wait to turn a little bit. You gotta wait to turn a little bit, but once that time comes, get that hang time, this video will be perfect for you, so I'm not gonna really do too much talking. I already pre-recorded the styles themselves. I'm gonna just talk over them a little bit and then go from there, but if you got waves or an afro or something like that, bro, get locks. Grow your hair out, get locks. I'm telling you, it's the best hairstyle in the world. I would never lie to y'all. Trust me. It turned me into a 55 overall, no badges, to a 99 with all the Hall of Fame, and especially the personality badges. Hall of Fame. You can't even upgrade personality badges, but it's possible. Get locks. It's possible. I'm telling you. So, I ain't gonna do too much talking. Let's head right into today's video. And if y'all don't know, if I'm looking down, that was on my phone right here. So, yeah, but with the first hairstyle, we have the hair down. Now, like I said, I didn't really know if I wanted to add this because this was like a bland one. But what I will say is before I get into the East style, having a haircut increases East style out. If you don't got a haircut, I mean, some of these I probably wouldn't do. Depending on how your hair go back, me, I be going back side, bearings, hella hair. So, it just depends. But overall, all of these styles look better when you have a haircut. So, having your hair down, this is one of those styles you really don't need a haircut crazy but having it increases it a lot but you know hair down normal it's normal it's chill nothing much to it you feel me it's calm it's a calm hairstyle not too crazy simple now for my next hairstyle we have the hair back now this is pretty much the same one as the hair down but like i said here's when the cut comes involved all you really do I'm gonna pop up a tutorial for every clip, so I ain't gonna demonstrate it, but all you're doing is just pulling your hair back. If you have a haircut, like I said, it shows off the hairline, a little bit of the uh, fade, depending on what type of haircut you got. Great style if you don't have a rubber band to put it up or nothing like that. Great alternative to show off the cut, show off the fade, show off the fade, everything like that. Good one to have. Now, next up, we have the Ja Morant. Now, personally, I call it the Ja Morant because I feel like he made this hairstyle more popular than what it is. But this is probably not my personal favorite. Simply because, maybe if I had like a tapered dress, but I have like the drop face. So, it's like, it don't look as good as it could look. So, if you have like a tapering dress, this hairstyle will most definitely be for you. I'm not going to lie. It fits that well. Kind of similar just to the hair down one. It's just, you have like a, a mini ponytail at the top of your head. So, that's what that one is. Still a good one. Not my personal favorite, but it's still a good go-to that you could do. Now, next up, we have the regular ponytail or bun. Now, I added these two together because it's pretty much the same thing, just in kind of like a different form. Now, this one I count as the regular ponytail because it's just like the hair going back. And then the bun one is like when it's on top of the head. So, this is probably my all-time favorite. This one right here, the regular uh, ponytail. But you have to have haircuts for these. Like, you can't be having the, these, the buns, the ponytail, and you don't got a haircut. That shit, personally for me... That shit looks, it looks, it looks horrible. Hair coming down, sideburn showing. I can't do it. I gotta have a cut if I do this. So, if I ever do this style, just know I got a haircut coming with it. So, my personal favorite, hair won't be in the face at all. It's to the back. Dread still look good. Cut looking crazy. You can see the full cut. So, and you can see your earring too if you wear accessories and shit like that. So, this is probably my personal favorite. Personally, good ones to have. If y'all got long hair, especially, this one's the one for you. I promise you. You're gonna get all the hugs. Trust me, you're gonna get all the hugs.
Next up, we have Pigtail. This is one that I kind of never did before. I tried it. I seen it on TikTok. I'm like, I might as well try it. I never tried it before. Did it, and it didn't look that bad. Not my personal favorite, but it could be used. You know, you could go one pigtail, two pigtails. Really, however many you really want. I did two in the video, so pretty much just that. Self-explanatory. Pigtails, if you want to go there, go there. I feel like it's not the worst one. In my opinion, it's a mixture of... In my opinion, it's 50-50 with the John Moran one and the pigtails. But my opinion might be different from yours. If y'all might like it, but it's still a good style to rock. And then for my last two, I couldn't really show these off because I don't have the styles up. But we got two strand twist and barrel twist. Now two strand twist is like now two strand twist is probably my favorite go-to style. Whenever I'm getting a retwist or something like that, it just fits. I, I, at first, I'm not gonna lie, I didn't like it because when I first got it, I didn't have that much hair. But like I said, when you have more hair, you can do a lot more to your hair, so it just makes everything look better. So the more I got, the more I started to get two strand twists, the better it looked. It just make your hair look thicker, and then when you take them out, it get like the little crinkly effect on the dread. So good to have. But then the barrel twist, I think I had those one time. I'm gonna be honest, the barrel twist, the braids, all of that correlating together, I feel like that looks the best when you have like a full hair of dreads or like the tapered dreads. That's when that shit looked the best. The reason I feel like when I had it, it didn't look the best on me because I got like the drop face. I couldn't fill up my whole hair with them. But if you got that, I bought y'all to get those. Still a good style. Looks good. So yeah. But that was indeed the last style on my list. I know this video was probably quick, easy, and fast paced, but for all my lock heads that got locks, I want y'all to I want y'all to expand with y'all taste with y'all hair, man. Don't be so simple. Don't always have your hair down. Show your face, man. They can show your vibrant face. I know most of the time if you got long hair. You probably want to be the cool nigga, you know, hair in the face, bro. Rock your hair up, twin. But besides all that, I love y'all, man. If you got dreads, I hope this video informed you and helped you out a lot. Go get a cut, put your hair up. But I love y'all boys, man. Keep going for me. I'm keep going for y'all. Quick and easy video. Your boy Ron is out, man. Peace.